happy when happy wednesday we're starting the vlog at 4 25 exactly i'm here to pick up ben um he's going to drop me home um because i need to head on to the salon i'm too lazy to do my own hair plus to be honest with you i want it straightened just a little bit so i'm gonna go pick the products at home and then i'll go to a local salon i'm using the sheath naturals uh, products for the first time so that means the shampoo the conditioner and so then i'll just have it straightened kidogo and then head on back home i think that's the plan um so i want ben to drop me at the salon and then i'll walk back home um i'm excited about the weekend how have you guys been huh i'm excited about the weekend i always feel like once it gets to wednesday the week end is almost um i'm headed this weekend we'll be going for we'll be going for my friend's wedding is it to my friend's wedding or whichever whichever preposition we'll be going to the wedding um to mary's wedding mary is a very good friend of mine um i if you watched the my video on the 25 random facts about me i talked about um how i applied to try to apply well tried after high school to apply and go to yale and mary was really helpful through that pro uh through the whole process because well we were in high school together but we connected more once i was going through that application process because she went she was at yale at the moment she did her undergrad at yale and then she's now doing her grad postgrad i'm not sure if she's done yet at mit such successful brains <laughs> around me so she's getting married and i can't wait to celebrate with her and her husband it's gonna be my basha fun trip ben and i love road trips especially when it's just the two of us we love such road trips and we're gonna bring you guys along so super excited for that for now let's go take care of this hair i i really don't like how it looks me i do not like open hair but i'm challenging myself so I'm back home now. I took a very nice walk from the salon back home, which was very refreshing. Um, I straightened my hair lightly. This is kind of the length when you straighten it out. Kidogo. So I want to apply the black castor oil from Sheth Naturals directly to my scalp from their Instagram. Oh, here it is. I want to read what it says on their Instagram. Um, give me a sec. I want to pull it up. Yes. So they say the black castor oil hydrates your roots and makes them softer naturally. In fact, with consistent use, you'll, no you'll start to notice that your hair becomes better in texture and quality. So I'm going to apply this directly on my scalp. I'll leave the details on where if you're interested in any of these products. Um, of course, this is my first time using it, so the review will come maybe as the vlog progresses. By the end of this vlog, I'll have like a tangible review of the product. But for now, it's my first time, so I really don't know but i know for sure we used the shampoo the lady who was doing my hair used the shampoo and the conditioner and she was really really praising the shampoo saying that she's never used such a moisturizing shampoo before it's really good and even when i posted it on my instagram um some guys some of you guys were on my dm or in my dms telling me how it's the best shampoo i'll ever use so that for sure i'm yet to use it and actually feel it because um, it was a salon lady who was doing it, so I'm sure I, I did not, you know, feel it in my hands, my hair at that moment. So I, I would want to do that again. But for now, let's just use the black castor oil. I think I'll do my braid out away off camera only because I'm so tired and I just want to Netflix and chill. And yeah, I'll, we'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow when I'm undoing the braid out. Saturday it's the wedding day and guess what the wedding is more of a private wedding so I want to respect the bride's wishes and I'm, I don't want to vlog there I don't want to be all up in there all I'm trying to say is we're in Ibasha right now I am so sorry I left you guys off the last time but it's been hectic the last couple of days but today 
I've flicked the hair with a lot of gel and then I haven't done anything to it from the last time we talked because I just did a braid out and then I've just been I held it in a top pineapple kind of bun and then I've been sleeping I think you're with a skinker I'm with the Andangan so anyway we are on our way to the wedding it's been one it starts at 2 30 and it's a very fast paced wedding because the vows are at 3 no the ceremony starts at 2 30 and ends at 3 so by 3 the vows will be over and guess what time it is right now it's 2 37 so guess who's missing the vows <laughs> but i was just i just took out the camera to fill in you guys in on what I've done with my hair. I've added her given hair extensions, which I really like this style. It might make my face look a bit chubby and my facial features more prominent, but heck, we're embracing and this is Ben's favorite style. <laughs> Okay, who do we have here? Hi guys, welcome to our channel. In Nairobi, Ghana. 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 Yeah, he's, 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 he's coming in, he's coming in. We have young in. He's with the vlog. He's the guy. <laughs> this is my baby brother. And he's young. How cute is he? Look at him. He's like so he's young. Cute. I see you over 25s, 24s, 26s. This guy is young. Chicks, move on. So, uh, where are we so? I think we are at the so Baba. We are at <laughs> we are we're at Habesha restaurant. And we are having some very cool um, um, um We're gonna have some special kit form. Some special kit form. Uh, this is minced meat, uh, which is raw, which is lightly, even thoroughly cooked, served with Aye Bogomen. <laughs> See, I'm just reading the description. Aye Bogomen, okay. And then we have. And then we're yeah. gonna have some shiro. Su Susan has actually convinced us shiro. to have some vegetarian. No, you get it. Vegetarian, like you agree. Shiro, on a Sunday. shiro Tegamino. I'm sure it has a lot of anxiety in it. That's, that's shiro. <laughs> <laughs> so what's the milk comes out? Um, we'll show you how it looks like. Yes, I, also do. know, I also don't know how the food looks it's like. Me, it's me, I know how it looks like. But uh, let's see, let's see. Vegetarian. If Sue promises and it's true, then, then she's probably. ready to leave this country. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> Vote for Sue in the This meal is a bit complex than I thought, so we have the legumes over there. I'm sure it's some Ethiopian stuff. I'm sure it's something that can heal even. Then we have the meat, some popcorn. I don't know if these are popcorns, but those ones and some. Also eating them with some hot towels. It's gonna be a full meal, guys. I just realized that shame on me I wanted to end this vlog before I told you guys um, how the products how the chef natural products have been working for me because I'd mentioned them um, at the start of this vlog so I wanted I listed down my hair problems because I wanted to match my hair problems to the product itself and the products themselves and then see what will work for me so the first issue that I've been having is that my hairline is slightly deformed if you look very carefully let me song um, if don't worry if my foundation is not blended properly, we didn't have time in the morning. But if you if you can see very well, there are patches over here, and then also on this side, slight patches, and that's how that has been a very big problem for me. So what I've been using is the um uh, yeah this one, it's the palm, it's the palm kennel oil, um from. Chef Naturals, and I dare say, I, I'm gonna jump the gun here and say, I'm seeing results because this you can't tell me that this is not my hairline coming back. It is, it is. So, what I do is I massage, um, I massage, massage, whatever this product 
which if you're a sucker for it smells you're gonna have to make do with what you get um, I've been massaging it every single night or every so often or every other night onto my scalp just gently onto my not my scalp but my hairline area and me I dare say you can't tell me this is my hairline coming back it was worse than this um, the next issue that I have is volume my hair I really am a sucker for voluminous hair and I really wanted volume um, I want volume in my hair and so what I've been using is the black castor oil this one it has a great applicator so I just like directly onto the scalp too I apply it doo -doo 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 in a tiririka then I just massage it very well into the scalp and for that maybe I'm jumping the gun but I think I like it I like it um the other issue the other way that I use this one I find that it's a great sealant because another issue for me was moisture I was struggling to get moisture um on my hair so i either double between this one or the coconut oil i don't use this as a sealant as much as i use coconut oil uh, for my lock method but if i use coconut oil and then again i massage this onto my scalp i find that my hair in the morning is the moisture is just right for me um the next issue that well, i've covered three issues i received my hairline was a mess but I've covered three issues I've covered three issues so that that's my hairline that was thinning out and was literally a mess using the palm kernel oil to fix that and then volume I just massage to get volume and more that um, it encourages hair growth so if I direct the black castor oil so if I directly apply it on the scalp um, it feels really good and I I find that it adds moisture onto my hair that if I use coconut oil and then after Nimeshuka Matuta Zangwe I just put it on the scalp and then I massage it in by morning I find that my hair is moisturized visuri um, the next thing that the problem a problem that I've been having is that there's been a lot of shedding um, in my hair when I do when I'm doing my kawaida wash day or I'm doing um, washing or I'm just detangling there's a lot a lot of shedding and one thing one thing that I noticed that has helped over time is I pre poo my hair now me I'm a lazy naturalist before I think of pre pooing washing that's a whole day of doing things to your hair but I've noticed if I pre poo it really when I'm washing it it really really reduces um, what is it called shedding so I've been using coconut oil to help with pre pooing and then most of the time I sleep I just bomo the hair usiku or if I'm doing a wash the next day I make sure I pre poo that night then in the morning it's easier um, the next problem that I have which I haven't found like a direct uh, not a direct but i haven't been so intentional in fixing is i need quick styles in the morning you know my hair is not a tiile uh, you you know it's naturally curly so if you just apply this wash and go gel at in the morning you wake up and you're just like wow so what did you do to your hair and then those people are like literally nothing if it were me you would probably say you need to go back and fix your hair darling like your hair is a mess that's not a wash and go that's a mess so I haven't tried this product yet on a wash and go only because I'm scared as I've told you as I've said me I'm just fear of just not looking cute with a wash and go but you know what we're gonna try and I'm gonna try and share that with you guys um the next product that I have it oh this one is beds oh but well I mentioned it you know what we're gonna go give him this product and find out how he wants I don't know why I've never given him um yet we've been together so many so many days after I got this product but don't mind the lip liner it's a different day i'm not sure about this lip liner i'll add some magic onto it but i brought the hoba oil for ben yes Here so what's, what's what's this and what's what is it for you figure it and out where do i apply it you figure it out for real mm -hmm. then you tell us okay so uh, review you, if you like it okay so i'll be sampling it for a week that's mm -hmm. not just me, it's me and my team. We all have to <laughs> share droplets. So what's the one place you think you can use it for? I know it's great for skin. Well, um... But you don't have acne prone skin. No, no, see, uh, bald head. Can I all my relationships? <laughs> give me a week, give me a week. We'll be back here yeah, for relationships. No, oh, you mean friendships. the friendships? Yeah, okay. yeah, all right, yeah. Great. What's up? Ours is already oiled. Crazy, crazy girlfriend in the building. <laughs> 